Hi, my name is Vesna Novak, and in this video, I'll show you what automatic program repair is and how we can improve it. Imagine you have some source code, for example, in Java and a passing test that invokes your method. Then you decide to change the method and the way you calculate the return result. When you're done changing your code, you commit and push the changes and go for lunch. During your lunch break, a continuous integration tool pulls and builds your code and runs tests. This time, the test fails due to a null pointer exception. The test failure triggers an APR tool that generates a fix. And the fix is a null pointer checker and it passes the test. Once you're back from your lunch break, you have a fix waiting for you to accept it and apply it to your code. How did, did the APR tool know how to fix your code? Many APR tools learn from the fixes written and committed to repositories in the past. APR tools generate fix patterns out of similar fixes and common fix patterns are a null pointer checker or replacement of a variable or of an operator, etc. Finally, when a bug is detected, an APR tool chooses suitable fix pattern and applies it to the buggy code. The more fix patterns we have, the greater range of bugs can be fixed automatically. Apart from the limited set of available fix patterns, there is also still no general agreement on the representation of fix patterns. As a consequence, it is difficult to apply fix patterns, compare fix patterns from different taxonomies, and also to expand existing taxonomies. Our automated approach splits human written fixes into smaller chunks, clusters similar chunks using a threshold based algorithm, and each cluster represents a fixed pattern. It also compares generated fixed patterns with the state of the art taxonomy of fixed patterns, even though their representation is different. We got some matching patterns, which validates our approach and also some that didn't match the state of the art taxonomy, and they represent new fixed patterns. New fixed patterns will help researchers and practitioners expand their tools improve APR and fix a greater range of bugs in the future. 